Yeah. So what are what is what does the bill say? What what are you concerned about happening in classrooms? Yeah. So the bill specifically says that a teacher shall not teach about race and sex stereotyping. And Representative Myers, what's your take on this? My take on this is that this is, number one, a bandwagon bill that started in Texas and that it is a part of the GOP greatest hits of 2021. Um, I think it's a poor attempt at reverse psychology to sow seeds of division and hate by playing on the fears of individuals who want to say, we're not going to teach you about systemic uh, racism, but we're going to deny that it actually exists. I've been in classrooms consistently for the last 15 years. That's not happening. What is happening is an in-depth digest and conversation about the United States of America and where we started and about some of the systemic inequities that exist because our country was built on the slave trade. So critical race theory is not as a concept being taught in any public school in the United States of America through the K through 12 level. It is a legal doctrine, a legal concept that is something that was created by UW Madison graduate Kimberly Crenshaw, as well as Derrick Bell. The, the tenets of critical race theory itself actually stretch back to the 1960s. Are, are teachers teaching that in schools in K through 12 right now? Again, what we're saying in the bill is that teachers shall not teach that. We're making and it. And if it's not doing that, if clear. it's not currently happening, why do we need the bill? That's the question. Then why are we having Look, this debate right now? And why would we teach? Why would we need the bill? We have 424 school districts in the state of Wisconsin. For me to know what's being taught in every school district is next to impossible. I have had testimony from parents who suggest to me that some of this is being taught in the classroom. I have not been in the classroom. And, and Representative Myers, I, I think I know the answer to this, but what will Governor Evers do? Veto, 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 and I'm happy he will veto it. If Governor veto, Governor Evers vetoes this, then he is saying the opposite. He is saying that teachers shall teach that one race or sex is inherently superior to another. He is saying, specifically with his veto, that an individual's moral character is necessarily determined by the individual's race or sex. If he and vetoes this. That's specifically what he's saying. Not all this other stuff that people want to make this bill out to be. This bill no, is very fundamentally veto, clear. And if you vote against is a this direct, bill, is in favor of racial discrimination, plain and simple. His veto is a direct assault on what Christopher Ruffo, who is the architect of the critical race theory movement today, which would say the anti-critical race theory movement, when he said we have to successfully freeze their brand. If diversity, equity, and inclusion is the brand of the Democratic Party, I'm happy to be under that brand. Um, when we talk about public conversations and trying to use this as a political tool, that's what the governor would be saying with his veto, that he is not about political gamesmanship, that he is about well, equity for all children, the bill says. and that he is about training. You can't pack a whole bunch of stuff into the bill. I've quoted the bill multiple times. I have yet to hear Representative Myers give me one thing in the bill, a specific provision in the bill to which she, should, she objects. The bill is what the bill is, not what you pretend it to be. Representative Myers, you want to have a quick final word on that? Absolutely. This is not about critical race theory. This is about sensibilities and white fragility and how we can couch what our country has gone through. This is what we're doing. This is an assault on teaching and something that we can, uh, tr we're trying to assault our children from learning historical truths. All right, two very different views here. Thank you both for coming on. Thank you.